Hey guys, what's going on? It's your pal Victor here. And uh, I'm going to be doing some live drawing. Let me lower the volume on here. I'm trying to get back in the groove of doing some live drawing for you guys. So we're going to do some sketch cards today. And see what comes from that. You know, might do some... Uh, might do some Garbage Pail Kids, might do some non-related characters. We'll see what happens. Let me just pull some cards here from my Box O Stuff. Box O Stuff. I'm running low on cards, actually. I'm going to have to order some new ones. So that'll be fun. Grab a couple blank ones here. Yeah. So, let's see what I feel like drawing right now. Is that I expect it to kind of be quiet for a minute. So, uh, we'll see. Trying to get some uh, setup going here. Someone popped in here. It said just getting set up. running low on these guys so I'm gonna do a new uh new setup for those for my new uh personal stock once I finish those up I had no idea I was so low on those cards <clears throat> but always fun let's see what we do today's deal is I'm doing some uh $40 sketch cards for Valentine's Day so if you want a specific character I can totally make that happen. I also might uh, draw some non-Garbage Pail Kids stuff. I'm kind of wanting to draw a Joker. So that might be fun. Draw a Joker sketch card. We'll see. Maybe I'll do a GPK Joker. And uh, I got some new daylight light bulbs in here, which are actually nicer. A little less institutional. Should make uh, work a little bit nicer. And, uh, yeah, get some uh, live drawing done. We'll see how long I stick around. I haven't put a specific timer on here. But uh, if it's small, we'll get it going. People have requests, then we'll run a little bit longer. You know, we'll see how it goes. Play it by ear, as the people say. Hey, Michael, how's it going, dude? How you been? Oh, there's a pencil sharpener. Yeah, I haven't done live drawing in a minute. I need to get back in this habit because I enjoyed it. Hopefully I can do something entertaining for you guys. Whoa, I mangled that pencil. Oh no, that's better. All right, that's sharp. So. Yeah, maybe I'll do a Joker if people aren't feeling me doing a Garbage Pail Kid drawing. I haven't done a, I haven't done a, some uh, non-GPK stuff in a minute, but we'll see. Might be fun. <clears throat> so here's a blank. And, uh, yeah. Maybe I'll teach you guys how to draw a Joker today. Those are always fun. Like, teach. If you can't do teach, I always thought that was a shitty saying. But yeah. I feel like doing this, and we'll see how it goes. And uh, if you're messaging me, just hang on that I am... Uh, that I am uh, doing some live drawing. I may be coming to you for a large band GPK drawing. Yeah, I'd be down with that. Alright, so today I'm going to draw a classic Joker. There's six people here. That's nice. Like I said, if you have a request, feel free to shoot them at me. Alright. So, classic Joker means, you know, kind of like comic booky, not Heath Ledger. 
This will be in my style. I tend to use scratchy lines when I do comic stuff. I always feel that the Joker should have slightly bigger or slightly smaller eyes than regular people. And I apologize if the drawing moves. I didn't tape it down. Alright, so they're a little bulgy. And now we're going to do the nose. And Joker, I kind of like tend to give this kind of devilish nose, like a goblin. And then here we go with kind of the cheeks, because he should have cheekbones. And we use this bump to kind of start laying out the smile. There's a lip, right? And then I give the Joker big teeth because he should have big teeth. And then there's the lip. And then we kind of start making the mouth a little more angular. Bring it down. And then here's the ear. I think you can already kind of see it, can't you? And then we start defining the eye socket. There we go. Just define the face as you go along. Now we go the eye there. That's the you know the bump. And we kind of do the same thing over here. And then there's the other eyebrow. Let's define the mouth now. And then the other corner. So do you do the same process when you draw GPK. Yeah, there's kind of always the process there. You know, there's I start with the circle, then the ears, then I laid out the eyes, then the kind of like, you know, it's not a circle for the eyes. This is kind of like uh, dumpling eyes, then the nose, which is whoop, whoop, whoop. And then usually it's uh, the corner of the mouth, and then the other corner. You know, that's how I kind of do it. All right. So you see that comic book Joker? All right. So now let's do the hair. And he always kind of has curly hair in the comics. But I'm going to show you a little trick I do on the Joker to suggest he's evil, too. I always see this Jim Lee do this, and I think it's one of the most clever things ever. And a lot of people don't catch it. So you see that? You know, it's kind of curly. It's a little disheveled. But here's what Jim Lee does that I think is really cool. So here we go. He always has a curl here and one here. And they look like devil horns. And that's always like a funny little thing he does that I think is cute that makes you think that Joker's a bad guy because he is. Alright, 
And now, you know, here's a fun thing. We're going to do a little bit of erasing because, uh, you know, sketch. You start sketching and then you build up the actual drawing. Because these guys are a little inhuman and Joker should have a little... His, uh, his jaw should be a little bigger than a normal person's. There's the collar. There's the collar. We're going to do the suit. And Jim Lee did this one one time I liked. We gave him this kind of like big bow tie. It's kind of like the version I like. They actually made a... Uh, figure of the Joker I like this with the big bow tie DC directed and it's my favorite Joker figure get a little bit more hair there and a little crow's feet because bad guys should always have crow's feet He's just misunderstood, right? There's a joker, and then we're going to add some color. Like I said, I'm still open for commissions tit right now, so if you guys want to see me draw like a garbage pail kid joker after this and you want to buy it, send me a message. We'll make that happen, you know? So I'm doing, uh, you're like, what's with that blue? I'm like, Joker's face is usually white. So I tend to do blue highlights. You might have noticed, like, huh, Victor, you're, when you do comic stuff, it seems like uh, a little bit more polished than your GPK stuff. It's like, no, it's just angular. I tend to, I tend to have an angular art style and uh gpk stuff tends to be a little more round so it's all about making it work for me i enjoy doing both you know you should always do stuff that challenges you because uh you know if you get too complacent doing one thing then it's not really fun you know And we'll add pink to his cheeks just like we do garbage pail kids. <laughs> All right, that looks good. Let's do some eyes. And, you know, I always do green eyes for the Joker because, you know, that kind of makes sense. And since we're already doing green eyes, let's work on his green hair. You guys like how this is coming out? Find it interesting? I'm all, I'm all about feedback, guys. Just leave a comment and I can talk back to you while I'm doing this. I really like this green for his hair, though. And we'll add a darker green, you know, to highlight that in a little bit. And then let's uh, do some mouth. All right. 
right. Now we'll do the top lip. I leave some white as kind of like a glossy highlight. Thanks, man. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Do some gums. I didn't do like pink, pink because I kind of feel like Joker's gums should be a little damaged. do some uh, different green. This is kind of like the highlight. Yeah, it's funny, I almost never draw a comic book style Joker, you know? So it's kind of nice to just, uh, you know, do that for a change. I always draw movie jokers or garbage pail kid jokers. Now, so I'm using this darker green almost as like a. Uh, like I'm inking, you know, those darker lines to define it a little bit. I haven't decided if I'm going to go over this with a black marker yet. I don't think it really needs it. doing this uh, gray around the eyes like his eyes should be a little sunken in that's what I'm doing this for alright now we'll do some uh do some pink around his cheeks. I don't want to do like too pink, so we're going to use this. It's like flesh color, but it gives it kind of like a sickly feel to it. All right. And we'll do some yellow around the eyes here. Like they're kind of sickly. What's up, Adam? How's it going? Doing a little green around that eye. Different green than I did on the hair. Yeah, that looks good. And we'll do the shirt here. Yeah, I wanted to have a green shirt. And now what color are we gonna do this this tie. Let's do a dark blue. Keep it comic booky, yeah. It's not really a dark blue, just a darker blue, and I used on his face. Like how that ink just flows. 
Like, yeah. I'm enjoying this drawing. All right, and now let's get, get us some of that purple suit action going. Isn't that fun? It's like, whoa, you can see it happening right there. Michael says, I am seriously leaning towards ordering a card from you today. <laughs> oh, hey, I'm all for it. Help me pay my bills. <laughs> All right, so this color is called warm gray. I'm trying to get it to show up. But the reason I like it is just it's kind of just like you add it to skin tone it just kind of gives it this like sickly kind of thing going on. Also works on teeth. trying to find uh, I have so many of these pens they're all a little dull because I because I have used them all up on the past few sets you yeah, feel free to look look at that that's good. But that one's also too light. It's like, I'm gonna find you. <laughs> well, my fifth number two pen. I have to like start throwing these away once they get a little old. There we go. I think that's a good one. I just bought a Jason and Adam Bomb sketch card of yours through someone else. Oh, that's cool. Hopefully, it came out nice. Can't remember. Jason and Adam Bomb. I think I might have done something like that. I still have official cards if anybody wants some. Let's see, how how much am I going to ink this guy? Oh, cool, man. Message me. Jason had pink in it. Hmm. Well, to be fair, I've drawn a lot of Jason, so it's hard to remember them all. Cool, man. Yeah, I just saw it. Um, I'll, I'll open it up once I finish this.
Thanks, man. Yeah, this is my little take on how to do a comic book Joker. So this is a micron pen. It's just good for uh, getting in little detail. Almost done. No worries. Love your style. Recent grabs a mystery horror print too from your Etsy as well. Oh, awesome, man. I appreciate it. Yeah, we're running a sale on the Etsy too. So if you want to get another one, you can probably get it for cheaper right now through uh, next week. Victor always does epic work. I've gotten two pieces from him yet to be disappointed. Well, I'm glad you like it. Glad you like your stuff, man. I appreciate that. There you go, Joker. It's a nice, nice little Joker sketch. Not a character I draw every day, but I think that came out pretty fun. So that's kind of how I draw the Joker. What do you guys think? Fun? He 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 he. I'll throw him. I'll throw that one up on eBay or if anybody wants it, I can do 20 bucks on it. Eh, not too shabby. Did you guys enjoy that live drawing? 30 minute Joker. Boom. <laughs> 
Um, all right, what I'll do is, if anybody wants, uh, oh, cool, man, I will answer you in a minute. Well, since it seems like uh, people, nobody wants to get a, uh, a uh, one another sketch right now. Um, I'll co I'll call it a day, and then I'll come back on tomorrow and do another one tomorrow, and I'll answer the messages I got while I was doing this. And this one will be I'll put this stream up on uh on my YouTube channel so you can uh, watch it later, and it'll still stay up here on my page too. But uh, I hope you guys dug it, and it's kind of fun drawing again. But uh, I'll answer all the messages you guys sent me, and we'll come on again and do some more live drawing tomorrow at 4. So thanks for tuning in, guys. I appreciate it, and you guys have a good day. All right? Talk to you all soon. All right, later.